Cyberpunk Edge Runners has done something nothing else has before. You got me to reinstall Cyberpunk. But more importantly, it's blurred the lines between mediums. I don't think I've ever seen anything that pays so much respect to its source material. The level of dedication and detail on this show is almost unfathomable to me. If you see a location in the show, you can go there in the game. That is just mind-blowing to me. To be able to watch something, see it, feel it, and then you get to go there and see it exactly as it was for yourself? That's special. Imagine if a game like Destiny did this. Picture. It's January 31st, one month before Lightfall releases, and a series drops on Netflix, or Hulu, or Watch Movie Free Now Online 123.io or something. This series is five episodes long, and it follows a member of Neo Muna, the new location in Lightfall. You follow this person, you watch them grow, you watch them explore the city, become a cloud strider and then the show ends with Kallus' forces invading Neomuna and that person you meet is this guy the one your guardian meets in the DLC not only would that strengthen this new character but also the world they live in and the player's connection to the game you'd want to find out what happens next Talk with this character, explore the new zone, and find the locations from the show. And this doesn't even have to be directly connected either. Like, maybe you're into League of Legends and Riot's new upcoming MMO set in the universe. I'm sure Arcane has you itching to see how Piltover and Zaun have changed. And I'm certain there's going to be a good chunk of you. You're going to want to find Vander's Bar the moment the game releases. I know I'm going to try. The details in Edge Runners is just unmatched. It's not just locations either. Studio Trigger took the time to learn as much about the world as they could, from how people talk, to the way they act, to the class divide, to the effects of cybernetics on a person's body. It just feels like a natural extension of the universe. And it's not like games haven't done this in the past with books or shows. Some of my favorite books are based on video games. Games have always had external media to consume, but never like this. Never to this amount of detail, and never this directly from the source. And if I were to be so bold, and I am, nothing else has ever done it like this. Adaptations are made all the time. It's kind of Hollywood's thing. Edge Runners isn't an adaptation. Okay, I know, based on the definition of adaptation, but I don't really care about that. Because adaptation is not a strong enough word to me to describe what they did here. They didn't just adapt the source material. Edge Runners is the source material. When something is this closely tied to the source material when the details are this precise this interlinked adaptation just does not meet the expectations this show has set i know what edge runners has done here is the future of games now i don't mean every game has to do this no one no one has to do anything but i guarantee that a lot more games are going to start coming out with shows. My only hope is that they follow the example Edge Runners left for them. And uh, that's it. That's the video. If you liked it, like it. If you didn't, dislike it. You know, comment, subscribe, whatever you want. I just hope to see you next time. Bye.